Sean, um, a tough afternoon, your assessment of, of that one? Yeah, it hurts. Um, do you know what? Everything that we had on Tuesday night in terms of the intensity, uh, we probably dropped. Well, not probably. We did drop our levels today and, um, yeah, ended up a really tough day. Yeah. You said in the week about the, the challenge of backing up such a high of Tuesday. Would you put it down to mentality, intensity? What, what would you put it down to? Today? In this game, I wouldn't put it down to mentality. I think uh, there was an effort. Um, uh, I just generally think I was worried before the game about uh, how much energy we had. Could we have the same intensity against Bolton? And we didn't. Um, yeah, I think uh, I give the players massive credit uh, on Tuesday. Uh, and this was a really big game and I asked some of them to go again and um, the levels were just a little bit below, but however much today hurt, I still can't be overly critical. A really difficult day. Um, I think there's definitely moments we can do much better in, um, but I have to stay pretty calm and uh, they were immense on Tuesday, but the levels dropped today and us, our, our levels dropped today. So it's, um, it's a tough day. After we kind of went behind, retook the lead. We seemed to be quite comfortable at two one, didn't we? At that stage, you should never feel comfortable in a game. I think that's that's probably uh, summed up today a little bit. I think uh, we went two one, but you still have to do the fundamentals. You still have to run more than an opponent. You have to block a shot correctly, or when there's a tackle to be made, you have to make it. So you probably saw, or I think we saw, a Fleetwood side fighting for their lives. Um, they had a desire and intensity to try and see this game out. Um, and their levels were just a little bit above ours today. Conditions obviously not ideal for, for both sides, but... No, they were not great for either side, so it was uh, it is what it is. I don't think that had an impact on the result. Um, fundamental things within the game were the difference. Uh, uh, we tried extremely hard towards the end. We had a lot of possession, but we needed to... Uh, we just kept going. We just didn't quite have that same speed, that same cutting edge we did on Tuesday. I think that's a consistency I've been searching for all season. Um, yeah, and I'll keep searching. On the positive, obviously, plenty of goals in that first half and Hump's starting to find his form again in front of goal. Yeah, Stephen, Stephen was uh, brilliant for the time that he was on in the pitch. Again, it was just energy uh, um, and uh, just a slight knock on his foot at, uh, at half-time. But uh, yeah, Stephen, Stephen did well today. So. Um, in a difficult match, uh, yeah, he was a positive for sure. And on the second, Tello started the move with the ball out wide, found himself in the box again in the right place at the right time. Yeah, he's adding that to his game, but I think what frustrates us so much is that we'd worked hard enough to get back to 2 1. And even at 2 all, look, uh, we can see the set play. Uh, and I know it's a deflected goal, but we work hard on how we block shots. And if we don't do that right, then you're, you're always open to deflections. But again, with Tello, I can't be overly critical. This has been a huge season for Tello. It's probably the first time he's been a, a consistent starter, or it is the first time. Um, so he's been very good, Tello. These are these are days that hurt, and um, I hope we remember these types of days uh, in the next few weeks and definitely into next season. In that second hour, Scotty came on, put his body in the line with a fantastic block, and then Tello goes up the other end and hits the crossbar. And on another day, that might have given a little bit, little bit of momentum to, to push on. Yeah, there wasn't too much between. Uh, between the two sides, really, uh, maybe that's where the conditions levelled things slightly. But for both, uh, yeah, it was uh, the chances that they had, they took, um, and we didn't defend our box well enough. So, um, yeah, it's a sore one. For those that missed it pre-game, obviously Jordan Jones wasn't expected to feature today, but he did. Again, a slight positive that he got some minutes back in his legs. Yeah, it's a big positive that he's available, and um, yeah, we need we need to get him right um, for next weekend. I think Johnny Smith has been good. He has been good in a position that he's he's not played before. So, um, yeah, it's good to have Jordan back. Um, as I said to the players, look, uh, all the credit for, for Tuesday it went to them. Um, but in every game and every moment, you have to compete. Uh, the moment you don't, you get hurt, and we did today. Finally, a word on the fans. Brave the, the weather and the cold today to come out. Yeah, they're amazing. I'm just, uh, I'm sorry I couldn't give them another, uh, or more feelings I could give them Tuesday. But... Uh, yeah, I'll try and I'll try and change that over the uh, the coming days, and I'll try and give them more away days. Uh, I know it's tough, so um, yeah, appreciate the sport.